the data mesh framework is um, formulated by Zamak Degani and it was driven by the market. It's come from the business side versus many other frameworks which have come th uh, throughout the times. And basically it really uses these four columns which you can see on your screen right now and it focuses mainly on the domain-driven data centralization, which means that instead of the data being put into a centralized depository like a data lake, it actually stays with the domains and domains could be things like marketing, it could be human resource, financial, because that's where the experts are. And this really leans itself very closely to the second point, which is data as a product. In the past, we've really thought of data as an asset. We collected it, we've had it, we didn't share it. And her idea is really to use it in such a form that it is shareable, usable by the business, that it's um, shareable with all the other pe people. And for that, it needs to be able to be worked on at the domain itself. And um, having said that, obviously, governance is very, very important. And you still need, if you like, a, a central, uh, central governance, which is like a federated computational governance. It's very, very important to make sure that you abide by the rules which are in different countries. So somehow, even though you have this decentralized situation, you need to have a governance which is centralized. And last but not least, because you want to enable the business, you need to have some kind of structure which allows them to self-service. So there has a self-service infrastructure. So when we speak about data mesh, these are kind of the points we're, we're talking about. In this